Hello, I am here to recommend Your House Will Pay by Steph Cha, which is a page-turning novel of revenge and redemption. It is realistic fiction, and it's actually based on real events that happened in the 1990s and in 2019. So I thought that part was really interesting. I felt like I learned a lot about this time period. Um, it's set in Los Angeles. In the 1990s timeline, it is right after the Rodney King beating, which had resulted in a bunch of riots that happened in Los Angeles. And around that same time, um, a shooting that happened at a convenience store. So Ava Matthews is the character in the novel based on a real life person who was shot as a result of um, kind of reactions to these riots. The shopkeeper thinks that she's shoplifting and she's not, but she winds up getting shot and killed and the shooter is not condemned or is not uh, convicted for that murder. Um, the other timeline is uh, about 30 years later in 2019 when Ava's brother, the woman who's shot, um, is picking up his cousin from prison who has been kind of in and out of prison ever since this happened um, and is on his own path to redemption, both of them, both Sean, the brother, and the cousin. Um, we meet another family who is um, impacted by, by tragic violence, the Parks, and these timelines intersect in a way that's really, really powerful, and one that's really thought-provoking in terms of how communities respond to violent acts of crime. There's, I've read a lot of books like this. Um, American Boys, um, All American Boys is one that comes to mind by Jason Reynolds, and I really love that book, but I think this book addresses the issue in an equally complex, if not more complex way. So one I really recommend, if you like that book too, this is an, another one to read.